hi guys welcome back to my channel this vlog is going to be a very a little bit different um i'm a little drunk from the wine and i wanted to talk to you about this wine that i'm drinking and you know what silver me is going to upload this vlog because it's kind of cute i am obsessed with this wine i thought it's so inexpensive uh wine and spirit is I'm not going to show you the wine yet. Let me um, go to this blog and then I'll tell you at the end. Um, it's literally my third cup and I'm like <laughs> so lit. But it's so good. I don't know if you're into dry wine, but I am obsessed with dry wine. I've always loved dry wine. Dry wine is my vibe. I don't like sweet wines. I mean, I do sometimes, but not always. My boyfriend loves sweet wines, so that's why I buy them. And sometimes I drink it with him because, you know, sometimes you have to... I don't know. What it, I don't know. The point is that I like my wine red and dried, or I do sometimes do... I do sometimes like white wine, but it has to be dried um i don't know what it is something about dry wine gets me going i absolutely love it and you know i don't drink as much anymore i'm i'm the kind of person i think i talked about it in my other vlogs that i stopped drinking and i don't go out and if i do drink i drink it in the comfort of my home like a cocktail maybe like a glass of wine or anything like that but, you know, I'm missing my boyfriend today, so I decided to drink a little bit, and I fucking love it. I love this wine. Um, I did, I gave Shaniqua, like, a nice couple of drinks. I did, I only had one drink because I had to drive it home. But I love that I have this wine, and it is so delicious, and it's so good, and I love it. I'm going to take a sip with you. so good it tastes oh this is like one of the cups that i bought at marshall's last week so pretty right it's such a pretty red wine glass i absolutely love it it looks like this i also make cocktails in this cup the cocktail that i made Earlier for Shaniqua, I made it on this cup. I don't know if I took a photo when I on my last vlog. I'm not sure. But if I did, you will see it. Watch the entire vlog, bitch. I don't understand why don't you watch the entire vlog. Like, why are you here and not watching the entire fucking vlog, bitch? Watch the entire vlog, okay? Anyway, um, I, from this, when I make cocktails with these glasses, I just pop them on into the fridge for an hour or 30 minutes and then i take them out and then i make the cocktail on the glass because you know these glasses are multi-use you can use these glasses for everything but i cannot wait to use my other glasses that i bought this week um because i finally have my collection of glasses like the little um i think they're martini glass and I only had one because I bought one at home stands with my boyfriend. He bought it for me because I loved it so much. And I couldn't find, I mean, I, I've seen the same glass but in pink. But who the fuck wants different colored glasses, you know? I don't like the vibe. I like all of my glasses the same. Same thing with, excuse me. I have another cosmo glass but my cosmo glass that i have is green and i have not found the same glass at all so i think i just have to buy a different different cup cosmo glass but i love that cosmo glass it's like a nice forest green and i'm gonna keep it but when i get the new cosmo glass when i find it when I finally find it, I'm going to get rid maybe get, I'm not sure. I don't know what I'm doing, but I just love that everything has, I don't know. I just like that everything, little by little, I'm finding things that I love and adding it. And my boyfriend doesn't have any issue with that, so I love that for me. 
I was going to wait for him to come home so I can show him because I also bought a different glass just for everyday use. And I showed him and he was just smiling on my camera. He was, babe, like every time you buy something, he, he was telling me. that every time I buy something, I'm like, oh, don't get mad. And he goes, babe, well, you ask, always ask me not to get mad. And then he goes, you always wait for me to leave for you to buy things for the house. And I'm like, oh, okay, whatever. Like, you're so annoying. Um, but it was nice that he support my the things that I add to the home. And I told him that I'm going to throw away some of his things because... Some of these things that he has doesn't make sense. So I um, want to upgrade them. For instance, his plates. I fucking hate his plates. I mean, I can keep them for server purpose, for serving. But I'm not going to, I don't know. They're just, they're just, they're just so stupid. Like, I fucking hate them all. Anyway, back to the wine. I know this is a drunk blog. Yes, it is. It's a blog. It's a drunk blog, and you have to hear me talk for eight minutes here or ten minutes, bitch. So it's not gonna be long, honestly. I just wanted to come in here and also show you my hair. I did my hair today at a hair um at a hair salon, I think. And this bitch burned my hair out. But whatever, it looks good. I don't know. What do you think? No iron, just my hair, my natural hair. I don't know, because the Dominicans don't, like, they know how to, like, blow dry your hair, but they don't know how to, to, like, give you waves, you know? I don't know, I think I like my... I don't know, I look like a fucking egg, like, just like that, but with my glasses, it kind of look okay. But I don't know if it's the angle of the camera that makes me look like a fucking egg. And I don't like looking like an egg. I don't want... I don't know. I don't... Oh, hold on. Maybe you can do something like this. I don't know. I look so weird. <laughs> like, what is happening? Absolutely fucking no. You know the vibes. The glasses make me look cute, though. Okay, now I'm going to show you the wine. It's so good. It's really inexpensive. It's less than 20 bucks at Wine and Spirit. It's called this. Sogno di Ulisse Monte Poliziano Bra da Bruso. Um, Tenuta Ulisse. I think it's an Italian wine. Let me see what it says up in the back. It is. Oh yeah, it is an Italian wine, part of dried red wine. It was made in 2020, and it is a imported by Carmine Selection Balas and Wood Kenwood PA. Is this one right here? It's so fucking good. It's so inexpensive too, which is insane. It's an imported wine too, which is wild to me that an imported one is so cheap. But it is so good. I think if you are drinking wine, you should do it dry, if, especially if you want to like lose weight, like me. Again, I don't drink wine a lot. I just, I just have like a glass or two. I don't know. I like to keep like one or two wines in the house. Just in case I'm hosting, and this week I've been hosting so much. I host yesterday. Um, I host last week. I'm hosting. I host today. I'm hosting tomorrow, and then I'm hosting next Monday. Monday. So it's a lot of hosting for me, and I cannot wait to host. That's the music. I have like super year. I don't know. Anyway, this is the wine. Hopefully my ch my um thumbnail catches. Let me smile because it's always catch me smiling. <laughs> so weird. I know it's so weird. It's so good, bitch. Whatever. Anyway, I'm drunk, so I need to go. 
Thank you for watching.